Hi and welcome again to Take It Out. This time we're going to be looking at a little cheapo purchase that I picked up in a UK store called B&M. It's a USB multicolour mood light and it's by a company called Barkan, a better point of view. It's a USB powered two strip light, that uh, LED light that you stick to the back of your television to give a bit of ambience I suppose to what you're watching and you can change the colours with a little remote control to match basically the scenes of the television nice and red if it's a, a horror movie or nice and green if it's a landscape movie and so on so we're going to unpack it and have a little look what's inside it and then we'll try it out switch it on and see what it's like i must admit my intention for this is not to be used as it is intended as a mood light behind a television but as a case light for my pc build and the reason that for that is this is about a third of the cost of a dedicated PC case USB multicolour light. So let's get it unboxed and have a look and see what it's like. So it comes in a little anti-static bag, which is nice. Not that you really need anti-static bags for LED strip lights, but all the same. We can get it open. It is a resealable bag, which is the bag will come in useful as well for other things. So here it's the actual strips, and they are backed with 3M tape. Well, I'm surprised. That's quite a good quality tape, 3M. If it's genuine, it looks genuine as well. So there we go. 300 LSE tape. So if anybody knows what that is, you can give a little mention in the comments below. If it's a rubbish version, then let me know. If it's not, again, let me know. We have a little mode switch there, which changes the modes. And then we have the USB plug to plug into the USB outlet of your television. So let's get this and wrapped a little bit and let's see what these lights actually look like as you can see very well terminated eyes i imagine you'd be able to cut these to your own length and terminate them yourself need somebody like big clive or one of the others to tell us exactly how you do that though i'm not that uh well versed in these things i have though got a little Texit power bank, so we can actually switch them on and see them working. So let's plug it in, and they light up. Sort of a a very bright blue white. Let's see what happens when we change the mode. Then we get multicolour flashing: red, blue, and green change the mode again and we go to a wave type light going from blue to purple to orange to green and back to blue press it again oh we get a strobe effect okay well, I'll get off that one quickly in case anybody gets some sort of side effect from it and we go back to the blue a plain red a plain green a plain pinky purple, a slightly lighter blue, a yellowy green, an even lighter blue, and we go back through the cycle again. So we have the rainbow colours there, the green, blue and red. And then the slowly changing. That's quite a nice, quite a relaxing type of mode that one. We're going to come back to that strobe effect in a moment and I'll swiftly move over it when we do. There we go. And we go back to a steady blue. That's quite nice. That's quite, uh, that'd match the colour of the PC at the moment, the Blue Angel. Switch the power on might help. There we go. I think I should name it now, shouldn't I, the build? Perhaps. How's about the Blue Angel? But that's not the colour that I'm going to be using in the new build. Then we got a nice red, which is quite a, 
How do I explain that? It's not it's not a blood red, it's more of a I don't know, an orangey red? Hmm. I don't know if his camera picks it up quite so well. And that's quite a nice green. That would that would be really nice with a green build. I like that one as well. It's hard to describe it, but it's like a metallic green. Strange. And then the purple or pink. And again, this very now this is more of a metallic os, I suppose. Not not a sky. It's too bright for a sky blue. Definitely a metallic-y type of blue, though. Again, very nice for a case build. And we go back to the very yellowy green. And then the white. I'll probably be using this one because the area I want this actually used in is the front of the case to shine through the fans. I'm actually going to be modding the case as well. Not too fast on that flashing mode. I do like this mode though. That's a very nice mode as well. And swiftly over that. The other colour I might use is the red. What do you think? What colour do you think I should use in the new build? I've got my own thoughts at the moment, but I'd like to hear what you think. What's your favourite colour for case lighting? Well, that is the Barkin, a better point of view, USB multicolour <laughs> mood lights, and uh, they work very well, I've got to say. Long life, powered by USB, energy saving, easy assembly. Yeah, can't disagree with any of that. Some fitting instructions there, just wipe the case down with the TV or whatever you're going to put it, and remove the cover tape and there's a little barcode there to go to Barkin's website as well model L12 there you go this was £10 um, in my local B&M case lights most of them they tend to be about £10 for a strip like this uh, normally when I'm shopping for them so getting two strips I think is quite a good bargain for now though again thank you for watching